Grubb, automotive artist. First time, the new bus has been out of the box. Pretty excited. It's got an elevator. Um, the kids are really having a good time going up and down. You might remember the Deco Liner, the first bus I did that has the fully functional flying bridge. This is built on the same chassis. This is a 1974 GMC motorhome chassis. Except this time we started with a Devco milk truck. Took a 1947 Devco milk truck and cut the nose off of it. And that's why I got this beautiful curved front end. First thing we had to do was widen it eight inches. So there's actually eight inches added to the width of the vehicle because that's because we wanted to stack the VW bus on the roof and we had to keep the whole thing in proportion. The Devco being a little bit narrower made the whole sculpture a little too linear and tall. So widening the piece really helped balance the sculpture by widening the base of the pyramid, which helped the balance of the entire sculpture. So up top, of course, we've got a real VW bus. It's a 21 window VW split window that we cut in half and stuck on the roof just for fun. But inside is one of the very, very best parts of all. This is designed to be a limousine for use in San Francisco. And the funnest part is how you get up to the upper floor. We've got a victim on the uh, inclinator right now and we're going to incline her all the way up to the top. So now she can step off and walk around upstairs if she wants. So this is just a big pillow pit upstairs, just a nice place to relax, kick back a little bit, maybe catch a few Z's. We went from drawing to driving in 18 months. Come on back down. So here we are in the downstairs area. And as you can see, it's just a nice big comfy spot to kick back with some friends. So you can see the interior is just set up for a limousine. The piece is actually gonna be used for wine tours in the Napa Valley. So if you're down in San Francisco area in the Napa Valley, look for it. It'll be fun and it'll be full of people having a good time uh, touring the Napa Valley. These are just sculptures that you get to drive. They're full function sculptures. And the balance of my sculptures and the craftsmanship I take a lot of pride in my sculptures, but at the end of the day, if they don't work, if you can't drive them and actually use them, um, I didn't build it. If it runs and drives and really works, it's a Randy Grubb original. RandyGrubb.com for the whole story. I've built a lot of neat cars, Jay Leno's tank car. Check it out, there's a lot of fun stuff. It'll make you laugh, I guarantee.